All right, guys. It's been a little bit since I made a video. It's been like, mm, I don't know, like a week. Um, I just wanted to say that uh, it's been a hectic week so far. And yeah, I've been very busy doing a lot of stuff. That's why I haven't really been posting a lot. But uh, today we are outside. Um, we got like a foot of snow this week, but uh, today's very warm. So I just wanna show you guys what I've been doing lately. So as you know, I got my snow groomer. I did my unboxing on that. Um, this thing's a, gr I, I love it so much. As you can see, it works real nice. Look at the trails, they're all nice and preply groomed. But uh, I had to close them off today because it was so warm and it's just so trashed. But uh, it's all right, it's still a great time. Uh, we got the sl sleds lined up right here. I'll turn the video around for you. Here, we got this sled. You guys saw this in one of my, uh, actually you haven't seen this one yet, I told you about it. This is one of my Polaris. This is the Super Sport um, 550. Super cool, super cool sled. Um, I really like it, it's got a really, uh, you can't ever get this sled anywhere else too. Uh, you don't really find them. I got this one off of eBay for, uh, like, got it in a four pack for $100. Um, I got this sled too. This one, uh, and another one in the house. But uh, this really, this sled's really cool. Steering's great on it. Um, hood pops open. I really like that. It's got the motor inside. Um, it's about as big as my hand. It's a kind of a smaller sled. It's the same size as uh, the. FXR one right here, but then we got this sled. We call it the grandpa sled. It's what my buddy made up uh, But uh, this right here is a uh, um, FX nitro 2012 version Yamaha this sled's really cool. It's 1000 Super fun sled steering's great on it. Got nice suspension. Got the license plate right here This thing's beautiful and we got the race skidoo over here Then we've got the FX nitro um, This thing is super fun. It's KDX KTX four stroke. Um, it's the Genesis version. Super cool sled. Um, I really like it. My buddy's also got the same one, Graham, but he destroyed it. Um, we put a turbo on the side, real nice big fan turbo. Um, took everything off, made it a long track. This is a really decked out sled, but uh, we ran a couple days ago and he hit a tree and ripped off the whole side of his ski. So I have to fix that, which is definitely no problem. And yeah. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys the sleds and wanted to show you the trails up here. Um, I think you guys will really like them and I'm going to go over a couple things um, with signs and with the groomer. So with this groomer, I'm going to pull it out really quick. First thing I want to say, I love I love it so much. Uh, the track spin, like, it's no tomorrow. It's so nice. Um, everything is super ex um, it's accessible on this uh, the track. Uh, this goes up and down side to side. Just push up to lock it in. Um, the only downside on this thing is very, uh, fragile. It's like not chintzy, but like very, very fragile. Um, so a couple days ago I was going and I hit an ice block on the side and it pulled, it pulled this whole side and everything popped out over here. And as you can see down in there, right here, it's supposed to be attached like this, but it ripped off right there. And also this side right here where it um, supports right there got ripped off. So it's very unstable as you can see. Here, one second. It's not bad right now because it's like iced on right now, but uh, it's very um, wobbly when it's not supposed to be. Didn't when I got it, but uh, I'll just fix it when uh, I put it away for the winter. I meant for the summer, but uh, this thing's super cool. Um, this opens right here. If I can open it. Opens. Got the cockpit in there. Other door opens as well. Shut this. Yeah, guys, I really recommend this if you are looking for one. Uh, go out to Outback Toys. They'll sell it for you for a decent amount of price. Uh, for it uh, on uh, Walmart, it's $160. I got this for $125 to $130. Go check them out, guys. They will save you a good $40. Literally my favorite part out of all of it. I made these signs. I showed you a little bit on my live for when I was doing the giveaway. Um, but uh, basically, this is it. Super cool stuff. This is, uh, I'm, I am, uh, it's kind of funny, but I'm the Williamson Fort Riders, which, uh, uh, my, uh, actual, um, club name for our actual snowmobile club here in Williamson is, um, Williamson Drift Riders. So I just decided to make it, uh, this, which is, I thought was kind of funny. Got the Polaris down on there. We got the snow groomers company over here. And then we got climb because that's literally the best snowmobile brand except FXR. So 
yeah, <clears throat> I'm maintaining them. That's the name. Just want to give that a shout out because heck yeah, why not? All right, guys. So today I just want to go over a couple things like that. I thought it was great. Um, trails, as you can see, loop around my whole pool, come up on my deck, down, and onto the woods. And I'm going to be doing a GoPro Raw video here in like, like a week next time we get snow. The day that we get snow, which I'm pretty sure is Thursday or Friday, when we get snow, I'm going to groom it. I'm going to make the trails really beautiful. And I'm going to do a GoPro raw out on the video, uh, out on the GoPro for the um, trails. Because I know you guys are going to love it. Uh, they go all through my woods. Uh, I built it up like the Ford MX, where you're standing in a ditch and it's very tall up. Um, it didn't take long to do it. Um, I can do a tutorial on it, too, if you want me to. Um, I really, I, I, I love playing with toy snowmobiles, especially in the winter when you don't have much going on. So uh, I'm going to be doing more videos soon. I'm going to be doing more uh, um, Supercross stuff with my toy, uh, um, the Ford SX, which will be fun soon. And yeah, guys, I'll get to that. Peace out. See you later. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and leave a comment below on what you would like to see next. And don't forget to ring that bell.